Now, after months of lockdown, schools are back and so is exercise in the playground. Before the coronavirus pandemic, thousands of students had been taking part in ITV's Daily Mile, a campaign to get children fit and active. Obviously, it had to be put on hold, but now it's up and running again, as Tom Savides reports. Keeping up to date. Hi. Hi, hi. Proud sponsors of ITV Regional Sports Report. And they're off. There's no stopping these eight and nine-year-olds. Just the four laps of the school playing fields each day, covering a mile in 15 minutes. We all enjoy running around doing some laps and having a little chat with our friends. Is it exhausting running that mile? It can be if you run too many. And what's your running like? Well, I like to run a lot, but when I run too fast, I get tired, so I have to walk around and just start talking with my friends. I do swimming and I also do running at school, so I feel like it's important to run and keep like healthy. The Daily Mile, backed by ITV, has been running for two years, with more than 6,500 schools signed up. Coronavirus meant it had to be put on hold. But now it's up and running again. At Hextable Primary, children and their teachers are allowed to race round in their bubbles to avoid contact with other school groups. Obviously there's less movement around the classrooms at the moment. Um, we're, ha we're not running clubs um, because we can't mix the bubbles. Um, so for the children to get out, be active in between lessons, um, is, is brilliant. It gets them back on track for their learning um, and it is all round good for their mental health and well-being. The daily exercise at this school is complemented with a bit of reading to fully involve all pupils. We've introduced an incentive called Miles to the Moon which is linked to a book called Here We Are which is our term book for the whole school. It's encouraged children to be active again and encouraged them to use the daily mile. Well, I've decided to join the youngest group, the reception class full of four-year-olds, just to give me a bit of a fighting chance. Come on then, show us what you're made of. Not bad. I think this lot are going to give me a bit of a run for my money. So, how did I get on? Well, I was pipped to the post. My dreams of Olympic glory shattered by a four-year-old. Tom Savides, ITV News. Yes, well done. And Tom, it was never in any doubt. Harsh but fair, Andrew. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>